The craft of manufacturing linoleum has evolved over the last 150 years. Forbo has been driving this development through its Marmoleum brand. In our eyes, making Marmoleum is an art which is not learned at any trade or school. In fact, only a handful of people have the skill to make linoleum. Let's have a look together. At the start of the process, linseed oil and natural pine rosin are mixed together in large boilers. The linseed oil absorbs oxygen and together with the rosin creates a flexible binder, the result of which is called linoleum cement. The linoleum cement is collected in containers and stored in a heated storage room. The containers remain stored for 10 to 14 days until the linoleum cement has reached the right level of consistency and elasticity. Wood flour is added to the linoleum cement, creating a firm dry mixture. Next, finely grinded limestone is added. Together with color pigments, they are blended to achieve a firm, homogeneous mass. The colored linoleum mixture is now shredded in various stages as it is being transported to storage lofts in preparation for the final mixing stage and creating beds of different colors of linoleum granules. One bed produces approximately 15 rolls of linoleum. Every bed has a composition of two till eight colors. The linoleum granules are now ready for their final mixing process. The mixed material is coming down by conveyor belts. The granules mixture of several colors is calendared into a one meter white sheet. A rotating knife and a special blade cuts the sheet into two meter wide slabs, each with a special curved edge. The linoleum slabs are then picked up, turned and laid down on a conveyor belt overlapping like roof tiles. At the other end of the line, a large roll of jute material is prepared. The fine jute mesh is guided through the line to meet up with the linoleum, where it will serve as a backing material. The jute mesh and the linoleum slabs merge in front of a large calendar. Two cylinders each of a different temperature and speed press the linoleum sheet onto the jute backing to its correct thickness. In the calendaring process, linoleum gets its visual marble structure. The sheet is then transported to the drying chambers, which are located directly behind the calendar. Every drying chamber has a capacity of 18 up to 36 kilometers of linoleum. After a drying period of 14 to 20 days, the linoleum is pulled out at the rear of the chamber. The linoleum now is in its final stages of production as it receives its finishing treatment. A specially developed finish is applied in two layers, a primer and finishing layers. Both are UV cured and provide lifelong protection to the linoleum sheet. After the finish layers are applied, every linear meter is inspected and released for packaging. A label with all information around weight, length, color, production number and more is adhered to every single roll. The roll is placed on a conveyor belt system which brings each linoleum roll to a central warehouse. In the warehouse, they are ready to be picked. Ready to meet new feet in all kinds of indoor environments like schools, offices, shops, hospitals, public buildings and everywhere where durable, beautiful, sustainable and environmentally friendly flooring solutions matter. Forbo Marmoleum. For better indoor environments.